Hi everyone, this quarter's theme is payments. To keep on being the preferred payment provider for our customers, we've launched Google Pay and more recently Apple Pay in Germany. In Poland, we've added Garmin Pay and also Apple Pay for business customers, the first in that country. Thanks to these convenient third-party services and the easy contactless payments using ING's own app, the number of mobile car transactions almost doubled in just three months. It's experienced improvements like these that have helped us to grow our primary customer base by more than 165,000 people this quarter. We're also collaborating with Dutch supermarket Albert Heijn, providing payment processing for a physical pilot store that is fully digital, from opening the door with your bank card to automatic payment for the items you choose. And we're innovating with our open source software, Fin. Fin enables smart devices to pay for their own usage. It empowers clients who have a product as a service business models, which are important in a shift to a more sustainable circular economy. On the top of sustainability, ING is one of the founders of the Principles for Responsible Banking. And together with more than 30 other banks, ING also joined the collective commitment to climate action. Within one year, we will have taken concrete steps to align with the Paris Agreement and to be publicly accountable for our progress. We're already living up to that accountability with our Terra Progress Report, making ING the very first bank to publish a climate alignment disclosure. For more on our third quarter, including an update on our KYC enhancement efforts, please go to ing.com. See you next time.